Welcome back to the channel everyone. I hope you are doing absolutely well. This is AT back with another video. So yes, it's yet another cryptocurrency video. So my last video got good response and like bahut sare log puch rahe the ki ha they had like a lot of questions regarding bitcoins and stuff. I tried to answer all of those on Instagram and I tried my best to answer it. So is video mein main dikhaunga mera apna mining experience using nice hash on the GTX 1650 and yes I'll be showing you guys the profitability what it's giving me as of today that is March 13th let's now get started so here is my computer as you can see we have a 1650 in it and the AMD Ryzen 3 3200G ha huh, this system is like not high end system jo ki mining mein use hota hai and all but yeah it is capable enough so let me power this on and let me fire up my miner and show it to you guys so here is our computer app and running and here it is as you can see i have a couple of miners here so i'll do one thing i'll switch to screen recording and show it to you guys for a better vision let's directly jump into cpu z and let me show you my cpu and gpu what i'm running on this thing and Yep, I think there is an update. Okay, I'll do that later. Here it is: the AMD Ryzen 3 3200G four-core four-thread processor, maximum TDP of 65 watts. I have a 450 watts power supply here. This thing doesn't pull that much because the graphic card is also 1650. So, but still, 450 watts is more than enough. As you can see, the graphics: NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1650. This is the ASUS Phoenix card, 4 GB DDR5. and yes this is the single fan variant what i have got here graphic cards man graphic cards are out of stock these days the prices are just like double than what we had seen if a graphic card was launched at like say 15000 it's like retailing at somewhere around 25k right now but yes if anybody needs graphic cards out there you can just ping me on my instagram i have my instagram id link in the description i have two different ids one is my store that's all about technology stores you can visit that too and yes another one is my id where i reply to all people either of that you can select anyone and you can ping me over there i have graphic cards at pretty affordable prices the thing is i have partnered directly with wholesalers i can say they get their stock directly from manufacturer that's nvidia or you can say asus or msi and that so i can give you graphic cards at pretty affordable prices you can just ping me on my instagram for more details yes all are genuine and you get manufacturer warranty with it shipping all across india and if you want it abroad we'll have to discuss about that for more details visit my instagram link in description so let me just fire up nice hash miner yes the reason why i'm using nice hash miner is because this is one of the finest mining application that i have ever used i can say for sure because i have a few other miners on my system here as you can see i also have this unminable so this thing what it does is that it actually mines monero using your cpu or if you mine on gpu it uses uh, eth hash then mines different coins but pays out in coin whichever you have selected for example if you have selected doge it pays you out in doge coins if you have selected trx it pays you out in trx or whatever coin it is the disadvantage with this one is what i have seen it is not as efficient as the algorithms of nice hash that's for sure what i have noticed and talking about the miner gate i also have miner gate with me as you can see and i have mined monero this much so this i mined using my old system which is not that efficient it's like a dual core processor uh, nothing crazy or going on there and for some reason gpu mining isn't showing up here and i'm not using this as of now I prefer nice hash and as you can see the devices here Ryzen 3 GTX G4 1650 let me show you the actual miner that I am using as you can see I have benchmarked all these but I have disabled those because the most profitable one for me was TT miner at 7.6 mega hashes and I'm using this one for CPU it's always Xmrig monero that's what you can do it says speed 624 hashes but i was able to go all the way up to 1000 hashes as well 1200 something let's start mining on this 
okay in 3 2 1 and go I have set it to INR by the way Indian rupees what you saw there so this will take a little bit of time then all the fans will ramp up now and your fan speeds will go up even the temperatures will go up so you need to have good cooling both in your room as well as onto your system I have enough cooling here so I don't have any issues I have slightly overclocked this GTX 1650 here not too crazy slightly overclocked there just to maintain that 7.1 or 2 hashes per second that's the mega hashes whatever I showed you earlier so once I did that it's maintaining that but the temperatures are going up to I can say 68 degrees Celsius that's nothing crazy it's good the memory temperatures are also up but yeah that's expected as you can see it's mining right now let me first show you the GPU before showing you the CPU as you can see it's down to 6.891 in the beginning but once the fan ramps up it will like stick to 7.1 mega hashes or 7.98098 what you're seeing here the one issue what I'm facing here is this thing here it says every now and then it like connection gets lost and it's like trying to reconnect and it gets reconnected so if any miner is watching it Please let me know in the comment section or connect to me on Instagram and do let me know what's the issue with this and it's not an issue of my Wi-Fi because I have like 300 Mbps of speed that's more than enough for mining. I'm using Europe Amsterdam I also tried to change that to India but nothing changes so that's why I have kept it on default which is on Europe Amsterdam the currency I changed it to INR it was on USD as you can see the profitability is lower today it says 59 to 63 INR a day mining on this thing but I was able to get a little over a dollar while mining on this yesterday so let's check what's the price of BTC today as you can see the price of Bitcoin is 41 lakhs INR and yesterday it was somewhere around 42 to 43 lakhs as well so that's why it was showing more profitability but since the Bitcoin has fallen down a little bit the profitability has gone down a little bit I can say here my CPU is able to mine as you can see 0.00120 MBTC here at a speed of 781 hashes it says let's check CPU speeds here okay as you can see 774 and 916 the max what we have seen here is 1159 but after a while it will like stick to 1159 1158 something like that and it will be mining like on that same stuff and talking about my GPU, GPU is where I have a little bit of issue here as you can see today it's showing a little bit less 6.90 but it was at somewhere around 7.1 it matters definitely it matters because if you are getting 7.1 constantly then yes as you can see accepted shares yep this is what it is 61 degrees it says CPU temperature already and mining on this like for straight somewhere around 4 to 8 hours it rises up to 68 to 69 degrees Celsius not an issue so this is what it is guys if you are mining on this particular setup and if you have a system like this which is lying around at your place and if you are trying to mine on that that's the 1650 1650 super will give you a little bit better 1660 will give you better performance 1660 Ti will give you better performance as well but the reason why I don't use that I cannot use that here in my particular space is that I don't have that heavy power here I mean my power supply what I can plug into this socket what I'm using right now is max to max 450 watts but definitely I have other sockets at my place where it supplies heavy current even a 1000 watt power supply can run on that so I'll be using that if in case I buy more cards so guys this is it this was a short little video talking about mining on 1650 as of today that's March 13 I hope you like this video and if you want more such videos to come up subscribe and turn on notifications also do let me know in the comment section what videos you wanna see like what topics to cover if you're interested in cryptos definitely do let me know in the comment section I'll definitely try to cover more and more of that topic this is all about technology 24 into 7 Signing off for the moment. You guys have a great day. Peace.